So welcome back to the channel, y'all. It's definitely been a while. I know, I know. But as you can see, I'm here at my shop, our shop. And um, well, this right here is a little section for Ravi's jewelry specifically, but we're gonna have it kind of scattered through the shop. You guys seen what it looks like with the TVs and all. But the main thing is the floor has been redone and it's so nice. There's no bubbles. And that's that was the the uphill battle we had uh, with the contractor. It wasn't anybody's fault other than probably some bad glue, I'm guessing. But uh, now we got some track in here. It's a track I had at the first apartment um, at the moment. All the track and um, parts, basically inventory that I'm going to be selling uh, is at the apartment. So I kind of just brought over what I had from my apartment I have now. And uh, so I don't have any mini four wheel drive stuff at my place. It's just now every mini four wheel drive thing I got is here. Um, so we were just slowly, slowly, I've been slowly, slowly getting the, you know, things over here. Uh, it's hard to get the car down in downtown. So I've been using the motorcycle a lot to get uh, stuff from the apartment uh, here. So it's been kind of a slow transportation thing. Um, other than that, uh, I kind of have, my little corner set up for um, working at the moment. I mean, things are just um, not really laid out for, obviously for display or for shop use. It's just to get things in here and going. Um, but, you know, it's a process. Thankfully, uh, I'm in no rush to open as a shop, um, but I am trying to get this as, um, you know, going, I guess, as fast as possible uh, sooner than later. So we will be doing a few things today. Um, I'm gonna get the track taped up. I finally brought some scissors. <laughs> um, I got some really cool looking tape. Um, so I think it's gonna really go well with the, the red, white, and gray setup. Even though it's just an oval right now, you know, just to get some people's opinions because this isn't even here. Like I'm introducing this to Greece, literally. There's Tamiya, they know about the brand, but they don't know about mini four wheel drive racing. So um, I'm blessed to have this shop. It's mine, I own it. No rent, no lease, no blah, 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 of that bullshit. I own this son of a gun. And um, it's just, so awesome that I could just kind of spread my wings now and take my time and lay things out how I, I will um, and kind of want to uh, lay things out for the future because I could just expand this, you know, I'm only in my 30s so I could keep this going and hopefully expand it as big as Italy has it or more because that's, you know, the goal. It's inspiration to have a racing scene out here. And that is the main idea to have such a facility as so. Um, so with all this talking, you guys haven't seen me for a bit. So I thought a little talking won't hurt. Um, I'm going to get to taping the track up. Um, I fixed one of the track pieces. Yeah, I, it was about to break. Uh, thankfully, I caught it before it did. And now, let's get to taping. Before I do start taping, this is what I brought over today. All this stuff, some tools, some other, yeah, stuff. And um, 
I've been just kind of laying things out so I could actually get to working. Uh, my machine to suck in all the carbon air is right here, so I just need to hook that up uh, once I clear that space out. Or, I mean, I got so much space. I just, in the end, I am trying to utilize everything to maximum capacity. Um, I still have these two TVs to hook up some, like, I don't know, Xbox, PlayStation 2, and have some things playing, like, mini four-wheel drive in the background and whatnot. But, yeah, this is the behind the counter, all the shelving. Nice. And this is all, uh-oh, tool fell down. At the moment, I'm using this to sit on because I brought so much stuff over here. Um, I have all this ex excess, um, I guess you could, storage, yeah. Sorry, it's like four in the morning a.m. and I decided to come over here because I couldn't sleep. Oh, come on. Uh, stuck, there you go. And so, I'm here at the shop vlogging for you guys. I think that's a better camera angle, eh? Man, it's been a while. I haven't used my phone to do this. <laughs> Wait, we got these power strips that come up. So when people come over to race, we have enough power banks. Sorry for the banging. Um, here's just more storage, just regular storage. The goal is to, like I said, to utilize every bit of this to have storage. Here's another power bank, like over there. I think I showed you guys some of this in the beginning, but now that it's pretty much all done, just for giving you a little bit of run through. Um, but we're gonna blast up this wall and bring it along here with some cool graphics and maybe bring it along the glass too. So if you guys have ideas for graphics, I have an idea for this graphic. I'll post up right after I, after this. Um, but um, yeah, if you think of anything, just comment below and let me know. Thank you. is all taped up yeah enjoying the breakfast of champions red bull with a, a brownie but excited with how it looks it really uh, i mean it turned out really how i thought with the kind of caution tape look a very race car track setup i mean for a i guess you could say preliminary track set up for the time being we're not even open as a business so this is kind of just more for me and to introduce this to well whoever is gonna want to uh get into racing it i'm gonna i'm going to car meets and introducing it to my friends so slowly but surely it's fun it's here for good and um we have a lot of work to do so with that said, uh, I know I don't post much on YouTube anymore, but I have been trying to keep up with Instagram. Um, it doesn't mean my passion for mini four wheel drive is going away at all. I, obviously you see here, my passion is very big. Uh, things are just slowly progressing uh, to get inventory and track in here for the fact is 
uh, new life in Greece. Uh, this is brand new in Greece, so I'm like planting the flag here to make to me a mini four wheel drive something. Um, so, I mean, there's a lot of footwork for me and my family, really, because it's not just me doing this, it's my fiance helps out. Uh, I mean, she has her beads going on to my family, uh, as meaning my mother and father, they help out a lot, <laughs> you know? So it's, uh, I'm trying to do a lot on my own and with my family's help too, but obviously not overwhelm them. Um, because this is my business and my start off as my kind of hobby, but I want to share this now to Greece and to the community and, you know, get it expanded out here. It really turned me on when I went to Italy and I saw how awesome the community was with each other. Um, Maybe not so much with me because I was an outsider, but even so, like there was more than 70% of the Italian racers that are super polite and awesome. But uh, I would say 100% of the Italian racers have amazing passion. And that's what is a, I guess you could say, motivation to bring it here because there's a lot of passion back in the States too. Uh, it, this is a very passion oriented uh, hobby, sport. Now we're trying to get it to a sport. I mean, it's worldwide, it's where. So we are looking at this as a bigger picture. That's why this investment is for the long term, not the short term. And uh, all this said, Thank you guys for tuning in. And uh, once we have more things in the shop other than this, um, and you know, little things that I had from the house, I will um, tune back in, get you guys an updated video, and we'll get some more content going. Not so much build stuff and how to's lately, obviously, I don't got the time, but uh, if you have questions, DM me. Uh, or comment on one of the YouTube videos and I'll try and get, you know, I'll try to message you back. So, uh, thank you all for your patience and support. We really appreciate it. I appreciate it. It's a motivation. Uh, so, till the next video. Laters.